possible right there smile for the camera what you got what you got In the net. There we go. Yeah. Yep. That's it. <laughs> yep. Net for your boy. Yeah. There you go. Get him, bro. Drag definitely. Yeah. How many how many pound test leader are you using? Yeah. That's a good one. So you wouldn't think to come out here with 20 pound test, right? Yeah, he's big toad. Sweet. Dude, we're the master at the huge mangs. We are. Every time. Bro, like. Every time. Came on another monster. I'll wait till you get up. Hey, can you pick that nine out for me. Right here. Not the biggest one of the night, but it'll go in the box. Let them, let them run. That's good. That's all right. Bring them this way. Back at me. Dang, bro. Another monster. Let's go. <clears throat> dude, they know how to work. Look at that, dude. Nighttime bite. On the 3K. That is where it's at. Yo, we got the 3000s. We're all using these these 30s and 3000s. That's where the 20 pound at. main. 20 to 25 pound. <laughs> Floral carbon. That's where the fun's at right there. That's it, dude. You guys didn't even know this much fun existed. Another nice one. I'll leave that big one in there for you. Good job, bro. Man, that moon is just hanging out. They're greenies, right? Yeah. 
See, I think you throw it. You got a live greenie on there? Yeah, out there, yeah. Okay. Look, there's something under him. I just seen something long and skinny go swimming yeah, by. No, it's not too big, though. Looks like a cuda. Oh, you know what? I bet it says baby kingfish. You might get one. Did you put a decent greenie on there? Okay. I'm just checking, bro. I mean, I don't, I don't know if you really know how to fish or not. That's because I've been letting you guys catch. I've been filming. Backing out, didn't he? Yeah. That was the back out challenge. Dude, another monster. Wow, dude, I barely had him hooked. Dude, look, it about came out. Look at that. Look, Stace. Look at that. I barely had a little piece of skin there. That's why you gotta keep that line tight. Come on, come on. Loosen it a little too much. Big boy, big boy coming up. Woo, there it is. Yeah, baby. Open the yeah, that might be there for the biggest one, dude. That's probably the biggest. It's close. He might be. His is his is uh 23 and a half, but we gave him 24. See what this one is. Oh, he's 24. Um, look, let go. Oh, we're exactly the same size. He's fatter. Okay. Mine and yours are exact. 23. We're giving ourselves 24. Okay. <clears throat> well, hold on. We got. We got another. We got other stuff going on here. Oh, mom got one. Nice. Good job, baby. Yeah, that's the one I just caught, and then I I can't turn around and get that sucker in. You want to redo your line? Uh, let's see here. Oh, Caden on a monster. There you go. There you go. Man, that's big head shakes there. You might have a grouper. That are a big, big mangrove. Open that box up there, baby, so I can toss him. And then just, just leave it open for a sec, because I'm going to bring this one back there. Yeah, I see that. Oh, Ashley, come here. Big nurse. Look. Yeah, big nurse. Wow. Did you get the hook out? Maybe. On the, this one ain't too bad, so. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I'm, I'm walking over. Hold these. 
Remember, it's just 17. Fishing. I checked out the major and minor. I said the major was going to be about 11 to 2 o'clock. So we got out here probably about 8 30, and uh, it was a pretty steady bite. And then right when that major hit it, we started getting these big, huge ones. And I'm fishing with this the new uh, Saltis 3000, and it's got the big handle. It's got 22 pounds of drag. And I just got a very lightweight rod. I got the Tsunami Carbon Shield and 20 pound test floral carbon. Night fishing is really good to have this high vis. You can see it better at night in the spotlight. And we're using 20 to 30 pound floral carbon. You really, the 20 pound has really been paying off for the big ones. You wanna, you wanna get those big ones with the 20 pound test. If they're not hitting on that, go down to 17. And that's her, that's how we're doing it. Right there, that's it. Oh yeah, the jig hit. So, you guys, I get comments, like how do you get to the bottom with this little jig head? I mean, you see it, it's small. I'm a, what, about an eighth ounce on that one? quarter ounce you know that's what we're going to eight quarter if you can't find bottom keep dropping it that fish is going to swim down the way i showed you guys how to hook it through the bottom of the fin like that he's going to find bottom eventually and these fish are swimming up after him too we've been chumming the area heavy with, with greenbacks and oats and whatever we can find i'm getting hit 30 feet above water or above uh ground yeah yeah we're getting hit 30 feet even sometimes even yeah. higher so that's how we do it man that's the equipment i'm using and that saltise is way better than the quantum smoke the saltise is uh the, the the cranking power on it's way better the handle's bigger you got that big old round handle gives you a good grip and I like the color and the way it looks. It's got a good, uh, good strong reel right there. It's ninety dollars more though. That's the only thing. It, it does cost more, but it's worth it. Oh, oh, oh. Nice, man. Yeah, what? Yeah. Get him in the net. <laughs> oh my God. Nice. Dang, that's a thick one. Put him on the measure. Dang. Dang. Good job, bro. He was peeling. This thing is just huge. Look at that, dude. Gosh. How many inches? Hold them up. Just give me a There you go. Don't hold him over the water there, because he might go in. Bro, that's a big... Hold him up like that to me. Yeah, let me see him. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Look at that, dude. Here, let's see what it, what he measures out. Nose to the tip there. Yep. <clears throat> put your foot against that so he can put the nose against it. Yeah, hold it, hold it for him. Put his nose right here. You don't have to take him off. Just put his nose right here. And then pinch his tail. Twenty-four. He's right at twenty. Bro. Twenty. We give you twenty-four on that. We round up. <laughs> 23 and a half. 22. He's 23 and a half. He's actually 24. He's right there. Yeah, baby. Big old fat sucker. Yeah, buddy. Had to leave him down there for a minute, huh? I, I had to leave my line loose. 
Yeah, and let them swim. Well, I had a truck on that day. Oh, yeah. He just didn't move it. Oh, uh, look at all the chum. You know, I think that letting that chum float down there. Dude, that's a big one. Bro, I'm coming back with all freaking 19, 20 inches. Nice one, Kaden. No, the other one was bigger. That's still Wait, a nice one. Fish, That's what I've been using. That's what I caught the big one on. Yeah. I think it's the, the smaller one. <laughs> A little easier for him to eat. Yeah. It gets down there quicker. Oh man. Spikes. Did he get you? No, I wouldn't be holding my knee if he did. Hey, get over there. Yeah, I got spiked like that before. Where's the. There we go. Hey, we got doubles. Yeah, he spiked you pretty good, didn't he? Uh, I don't know, I can't see because of the light. Move your head, baby. That's deep. That's a little couple inches deep. <laughs> I can feel oh, it. Oh, man. You get the camera. There we are. Oh, Caden got spiked. Oh, man. He got the last of that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. That wraps it up. Check out the monsters. Hey, check that out, bro. We clean house tonight. And night fishing, we're a day before the full moon. Well, a night before the full moon. It's a full moon night. So, not sure it'll be this good tomorrow night. But the daytime bite on the nighttime moon really isn't the best for reef fishing. These mangrove snappers, they like to, they follow a, that moon schedule big time. You gotta follow those majors and minors on these. <coughs> All right. I'm Mr. Huge. Don't forget to subscribe, share, like. Hit that button, notifications. Once we get into uh, gag grouper season, I'm going to do some more videos on some gag grouper. We're going to start pulling them in. The Huge, let's go.